Oh, hi you guys. In today's video, I wanted to do a quick review on a very basic, simple item. And this is for a hiker's collapsible coffee cup. You may be saying, why on earth would you review a coffee cup? Well, it's because I've tried many different types of cups and uh, I've been very disappointed with them all. I'm gonna just give you guys some examples of things I've tried, things I've done, what's worked, what's not worked. And uh, I wanted to pass this along to you guys and I'll leave a link for this product down below. Now, here in my day pack, I've got this perfect little thermos. It's very, very small, compact, it's narrow, fits well in the side sleeve of my uh, day pack. And it's by Thermos. And this is what it looks like. However, the cup that comes on the top, as you can see, is tiny, you guys. That's like a couple sipper right there. It's a couple sips and boom, you're done. Now for some people, this may be okay. But for me, I like to drink from a regular cup when I'm out on the trail, just to kind of have the comforts of home with me when I'm out and about in the woods. And uh, though this will do, um, I don't like to have to keep pouring coffee and filling it up. So I'd like to, I'd just rather fill up my cup, have a nice cup of coffee and be done with it. So this is just way, way too small. But the thermos itself is perfect. I have tried lightweight aluminum cups, you guys, camp cups, and they're bulky, they're big. They take up a lot of room in this small day pack that I take on the trail with me. It doesn't have much of a vent hole, and basically what I gotta do is take my drill and drill that out larger. It just doesn't get the airflow coming in for you to be able to drink from this cup, so I've been kind of disappointed with that. That's something I can fix. And then you got these smaller tumblers like you have in your vehicle for traveling. Not practical, very big. Um, takes up a lot of room in the pack and uh, though these you know cups work and this one here does good It's just uh, too big for my pack So I was looking for a cheap and expensive way to just uh, have something on the trail And then I discovered this collapsible cup by Ozark trail that you can get at Walmart for two dollars and 49 cents However on the website it looked more like a cup, but then when I got it and had it in person it's more like a bowl. This thing is big. It's got a very wide rim. It, it's, it's very squishy. It doesn't feel very supportive of hot liquids. Now this may work better as a bowl. And uh, like for soup, I wouldn't recommend filling it up very high because like I said, it doesn't have much stability. It's very pliable, very soft. But the thing that I do not like about this, very cheap, inexpensive, uh, cup as they call it i don't agree it's a cup like i said it's more like a bowl when you go to try to collapse it back down it just doesn't collapse worth the damn you gotta you gotta really mess with it to get it to collapse it's not it's not very good so it just doesn't go right down flat the only thing this is good for is uh when i have gizmo with me whenever he'd go on a hike with me I'd use this as just a bowl for him to drink out of for $2.50. It's great to throw in my pack for that, but outside of using it for a cup or anything like that, I give it a huge thumbs down. This thing is basically worthless to use as a cup. Out of all the different things I've tried throughout the years, you guys, I've had the splatterware uh, metal camp cups. I've had little tin cups, nothing that I ever found that was all that great until I ran across this cup by REI. This is how it comes. It has this card that they have tethered to the handle. And I'll go over that in a moment. But this is the cup itself. This cup comes in three colors, black, blue, and yellow orange. And this is called Retro Sunrise. And what you do is you just pop the bottom out and there you go. You got a nice coffee cup that is actually the size of a real coffee cup. This thing is made out of very, very thick, heavy-duty rubber. And this backpacker's cup right here comes with a lifetime warranty, you guys. Covered for life. And you can see it could have a carabiner on it. You can attach it to your pack. It does not get hot in the hand when you fill it with fluids. So this cup is ideal for out on the trail. Can't beat having a regular cup of coffee when out hiking. The heat does not transfer through the cup and make it hot for you to hold in your hand like this at all. Very durable, has a nice flat bottom so it'll sit on a flat surface without it teetering. 
won't tip over, very stable, very sturdy. This cup right here holds 12 fluid ounces. It has a measuring graph on the inside. It is called Retro Sunrise. It's BPA free. Like I said, lifetime guarantee, heavy duty and dishwasher and microwave safe. Retails for $8.95 on their website. So I'll leave a link down below you guys where you can pick up this backpacker's cup. I highly, highly recommend it. This is the best cup I have ever found throughout the years of camping and hiking. This one is my favorite. Can't beat a damn good cup of coffee in the outdoors. So there you guys have it. Check this cup out. If you buy this cup, I do not believe you'll be disappointed. The nicest little cup I've ever found for uh, drinking coffee in the outdoors. You could use uh, this for a cup of soup and noodles. You could use it for soup. You could use it for all kinds of different things. Even if you want to just uh, pour water into a cup directly from your water bottle and drink like a civilized human being, this cup is perfect for that. The best collapsible, heavy-duty, lifetime warranty backpackers collapsible coffee cup so check it out down below you guys check out the three colors that uh, they come in and also check out other items on rei's website they got some really cool gear you guys you won't be disappointed you get what you pay for and uh believe you me this little cup right here is worth every penny to me because of the space it saves in my day pack thanks for watching you guys i appreciate your time watching my videos if you like this kind of content, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe. And uh, we will see you guys again down the trail. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.